Barbara. And I'm Karen, and we're the Sync Sisters. This is our tech bit on custom keyboard shortcuts. So custom keyboard shortcuts is this really cool feature that we wanted to share with you. Um, phrases or things that you find yourself typing in a lot, you can uh, just create a shortcut to make it easier for you. Right. Let's show you so what we mean. So first of all, let me show you what you mean. Anywhere that you type, um, you can use this feature. And right, so we're just going into the message app, but you could use it in mail or anywhere else that you're typing. And I'm going to type in a shortcut that we already have set up, and it is S-S-E. Now, if you notice down here in the predictive text area, um, it shows up our email address. I just type in that, and there it is. So we don't have to sit there and type the whole thing in. Right. It's amazing. Oh, amazing. I love it. Yeah. I love it. So we're going to show you how to set that up. Right. So we're going to go out, <clears throat> and we're going to go into the settings app. And we're going to go down to general and into keyboard. Keyboard. And then we've got text replacement. It's really hidden, isn't it? It is. It's kind of <laughs> hidden. So here's text replacement, and we've got some set up. Here's the one SSE that brought right. up my email, and we're going to show you how to we're do a new do, one. We're going to do a new, new one. So um, just like a lot of other things, tap on the plus. That means new, right? So we're going to put in the phrase. This time I'm just going to put our company name in that we're typing in a lot and it's a little tricky because we have that capital S in the middle right, right? especially when you're on your phone or something smaller right so it's really nice to okay have a so you type in whatever phrase it is and it could be long yeah yeah you could be a yeah you know I don't know what could, could be a long paragraph that you maybe add a lot right who knows and then you put in the shortcut that you want it to be and it would use something that will You'll associate with it, so it'll be easy to remember. And I'm so I'm going to put S S, not three. I'm going to put two, and then when you're done, I'm going to hit save. And now, when we go back into messages, yeah, go ahead and type I'll that. Go ahead and send that to you. Okay, save and it. then we just type in S S. Oops, or S A S S, and there's Sync there Sisters. There it is. Easy. Look at how easy that is. I love it. It's awesome. Now let's go back into that setting again and look at. Um, some great uses, of course, are the email. Email is amazing. And a trademark or registration. Did you know that those are emojis? Yeah. And it's way, way down. You'd have to scroll forever. So if you, for business reasons, are typing those in a lot, you can create a keyboard shortcut. Right. You can create a keyboard shortcut for just about anything. Yeah. Here's one that includes emojis. So when yeah. I type in L-U-M, it comes up with that. Right. Well, the T-M is an emoji, too. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Right. So how do you delete them if you didn't want okay, them? Okay, if you didn't want them anymore, you have two choices. You can just swipe across right. and hit delete, or you can do edit, and you'll get the, the switches, and then right. you can just come in and delete. Same thing, really. Yeah. Oh, that's a great one, On My Way. Yeah, On My yeah. Way, OMW. Yeah. I think that one might. Give that one, do, set that one up on my husband's phone. Yeah. I was wondering when he's leaving work. Right. <laughs> so it's awesome. It's a really great feature to help... Um, automate your yep. text entry on your iOS device. Thanks for learning with Sync Sisters. Thanks for watching the Sync Sisters Tech Bit. And please subscribe to our channel.